New bald eagle at the Bay Beach Wildlife Sanctuary. Lori Banksis shows us inside this rarely seen quarantine area where they're working on getting the bird back into the wild. Good morning. We're here at the observation building in our animal care department. And this is our quarantine room. This is a room that very few people get to see. This is our quiet space. And typically this time of year, we should be empty. But as you can see, all of our cages are full. Part of this is due to the very nice weather. What's happening is we're getting young animals that aren't the, able to find food because with the snow cover, it's sometimes really easy to find food. And then we have cases like our eagle here. This is a bald eagle, a female, that was found recently in around the Oconto area. And at first when she came in, we thought that she was hit by a car. But she actually, upon presentation, is showing signs of lead poisoning. What happens is they, the eagles will find carcasses to feed on, and if there's lead shot or other items in there, they can ingest this food, ingest the pellets, and it can make them very ill and very thin that you're able to actually walk up to them. Uh, this eagle is brought in by the DNR. They do a great job helping us out with wildlife, and we're actually working with her, treating her. So we're hoping, after a few months of treatment, get her, get her some good food, get her some weight back on, we'll be able to release her back into the wild with all the other eagles. We also have some other animals here. We have a young red-tailed hawk, and he was actually shot. So we're working um, with our vet on fixing up those wrists and getting her back out into the wild so she can hunt again. And she has a pretty good prognosis. We also have a young barred owl here, a small male, and he has a broken wing. He was hit by a car. So you can see we have a lot of different cases, a lot of different things, and year-round we're taking care of wildlife rehab with the goal of getting them back out into the wild. So as always, if you find an animal that's in distress or may be hurt, give us a call here at the sanctuary and we can help you out. Thanks a lot.